Oil systems can be considered to be either wet sump systems or dry sump systems. And a wet sump system is where the oil sump or oil reservoir is an integral part of the engine. So if, if we consider this example here, oil would be uh, taken from the sump by a pump and it would be directed towards the bearings on, on, the, on the shaft. So oil goes to all of these bearings. And then that oil would return to the to the sump. The oil in the sump then is used to splash lubricate the accessory gear housings. So these accessory gears they would drive the oil pump, the fuel pump, hydraulic pump, the integrated drive generator, and etc. etc. So the accessory gears are generally uh, immersed in this in this oil. So that's a wet sump system where the sump is an integral part of the engine. A dry sump system then is different in that the oil tank or oil reservoir is separate to the engine and then the oil then has to be transferred from the tank into the engine uh, by pumps. So we'd have a pump here and then the oil is sent to the bearings and then it returns back out to the to the oil sump or oil reservoir. So a uh, wet sump system, the sump is integral part of the engine and a dry sump system, the tank is external to the engine.